And last night's outbreak, Ardmore was hit by a tornado that ripped through one neighborhood, leaving a path of destruction. Carter County is among the 12 counties declared in a state of emergency by the governor. News 9's Cameron Joyner spoke to one resident about how he's hanging on to hope. She joins us live from Ardmore with his story. Cameron. Sylvia, the city of Ardmore is still completely in the dark tonight without power. They're one of those people that we mentioned are working to restore that power. But Plainview Estates was hit hard by the tornado that ripped through Ardmore last night. At least five homes completely destroyed, several more with minor damages. But to this community, it's what happened when the sun rose that mattered the most. I had this feeling you get them, you've, we've had them before that this was a real deal. In no time at all. And within minutes, it's over. The damage was done. You think you're going to have plenty of time, and there wasn't plenty of time. Saturday night's Ardmore tornado ripped the roof of Greg Pyatt's home. We're standing in the attic of, on the second floor of our home. What was once enclosed is now open, a backdrop of destruction. And the tornado just came right through here. Five homes gone. I mean, it's... They're, they're just families that are devastated. But as the sun rises, so does help from friends and strangers. Mm -mm. I didn't know anything about them. Bob Edinger got here Sunday morning, ready to lend a helping hand. I came down and then I saw all this damage over here. I had to do something. Spending his entire day uncovering the treasures of someone else's life. Photos from their past, at least as far back as when they first got married. Left to rebuild, Greg says it's teaching them all something valuable. You got to love people and use things and don't get them confused. Things can be replaced. It's really amazing. People can't. That you get to experience God's blessings. Someone like Bob who comes in that we don't even know just shows up and our friends that texting all night long. A community standing together. God's grace, God's blessings. Through it all. No injuries were reported in Ardmore, but the American Red Cross has set up a shelter at Christ Community Church on Mount Washington Road in Ardmore for anyone who's been displaced by the storms. In Ardmore, Cameron Joyner, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.